Well, hello everybody and welcome back to Lisa's Coloring Corner. Um, a diamond painting reached out to me, asked if I would like to show some diamond paintings on my channel for you guys. So there are 10 diamond paintings here. They very generously uh, sent me 10 of them. Um, so I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to split this up into two videos. So I'll have a part one and part two because otherwise I'm afraid this is going to get too long. Now it came in, you know, our standard China <laughs> paper when it goes through customs. So I took it out of the bag ahead of time to eliminate some time and uh, seeing me struggle with that. <laughs> so I think we'll open up the three boxes and two of these in part one, and then we'll open up the rest of these in part two. So I'm just going to grab two of them out of here, and the rest of this bag will be part two. So we'll do the boxes first. They are a little crunched, but let's see what the diamond paintings themselves look like. Oh, this is a bigger one. It's in there kind of snug. I hope I get it back in there. Now, these do not come in the standard, you know, like um, a lot of the others do where they come in these. It comes in these clear bags. So I'm hoping I can get them back in here. <laughs> I always struggle with these because it sticks on the sticky glue when you take them out. All right, now, as usual, I have printed out the pictures because even though they're in the clear wrapping, it's still kind of hard to really make out what they are. So... I thought my granddaughter would love this one. So we have, now of course they don't call it it, but uh, Elsa and Anna from Frozen. This is a 38 by 38, which is an odd size, right? Usually you have 30 by 30 or 35 by 35. This is a little bit bigger. It is a round full drill. There are 24 colors in here. And we do have the color palette, upper left and lower right. And as more of the companies are doing now, we have the number, the symbol, and the DMC code. Now this is a new to me company, so I do want to look at the drill field. We'll look a little bit closer at the drill field and the drills because like I said, it is a new to me company, but oh yeah, the symbols are extremely clear. And there is a crease here, but that should iron out. Some of this that you're seeing is just ripples in the plastic itself from when this is rolled up but there are no rivers or anything in the canvas itself. And that is due to the fact that these are poured glue and not the double-sided adhesive. If it was double-sided adhesive, you may have problems. Um, but because they are poured glue, you can even roll these backwards to get them to lay flatter and you won't have a problem with the glue. So. That's why poured glue is just so much better than double-sided adhesive, in my opinion. There are some that like the double-sided adhesive, but isn't that cute? So we have our standard tray, big sheet of wax, green boat, standard pink pen. Ooh, they are pre-kitted. So they are already in babies. That's always nice. Now, I typically don't work out of babies, but I know many of you do. And of course, I'm not going to get them back into this bag like this, but 
I like to show you all the pretty colors. So they have very nice big numbers on the bags. So you could reuse these bags also. That's nice, very easy to read. So we have this really pretty blue. We have an off red, ooh, some more pretty blues. So we're gonna have lots of blues for the background. Oh, I love that pink. Brown. So we're going to have lots of, I think, earth tones, like for her hair. Oh, I love that blue, too. Little bit of green. Here's a skin tone. Red brown. It's a real deep maroon. Some more. Blues. Look at all these blues. Isn't that pretty? Oh my gosh. Plus the other blues that I showed you before. Oh, that is so pretty. Lots of blues. And we have a real deep red. Some more skin tones. Lots of this color. Wow. <laughs> oh, another pretty pink. And we do have a little bit of a lilac color. Kind of a green gray and a red. Aren't those pretty? Oh, so pretty. Now, I like to look again for a new to me company. Let's kind of just take a glance at the drills. And again, it, it, it's kind of hard to tell until you actually do one of the diamond paintings, but I just kind of like to look and see what the drills look like. These look really nice. They look uniform in size. Not a lot of, you know, concave ones, things like that. Yeah, they look really nice sparkly <laughs> all right let me get these back in the bag quick as quick as I can zoom you back out this one may take a little bit because of being in the bags So I will try to hurry. Let's see if we can get it back in that uh, little clear bag. <laughs> so that is very pretty. Pretty colors. If I can't get them in these, I'm going to have to find a different way to store them. Oh, yeah. All right. All right. So, we have Elsa and Anna. Let me get my scissors out. Now, I normally write the company name on the white bag that they come in, but... Because I didn't have that, I just jotted it on the side here. Get my tape. Okay, number one down. It's not sticking. There we go. Okay, second box. That's true. I could put this back in the box, couldn't I? Silly me. See if I can get it back in there. And if I can't, it's just gonna stay in the bag. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna leave it in the bag. I don't want to crunch it up anymore. All right. I was surprised to see some come in the box. You don't normally get that. Okay.
This end or this end. There we go. This is a bigger one too. Again, it's pre pre baked. Same toolkit. And I thought this was so pretty. Isn't that cool? We have a beautiful, colorful tree on top, and then what looks to be like underground, kind of. This reminds me of like fall colors. There are 24 colors in here, and this is a 40 by 40. So a little bigger even than the last one. And again, we do have the number, the symbol, and the DMC code. Color palette, upper left, lower right. And again, the symbols look very, very clear, even in this dark area. What are all the hearts? Are they 310? Yep. <laughs> I think we're going to have a lot of 310 drills. I am going to test the sticky with poured glue. Oh, yeah. You typically do not have a problem with the stickiness of a canvas. Oh, that's so pretty. I can't wait to see the colors. So, again, all kitted up in those nice babies. Oh, the struggle is real, folks. The struggle is real. There we go. Crinkle, crinkle. It does not want to open. They always have these in here so perfect. I don't know how they do it. All right, let's look at the pretties. Hey, ooh, really dark, dark purple. Ooh, that'll be in the bottom, huh? Our three tens. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty full. Oh, look at these peaches. Well, a peach, <laughs> a dark red and an orange. We have some blues. Lots of different blues. Well, there's three of them anyhow. Brown, dark gray, dark green. Oh, here's a real dark, dark red. That'll be going up in the top for sure. Another dark green, a peach. Oh, pretty pink. Bet you that's going in the background or up on top somewhere. Oh, a dark like salmon color. We do have some whites. Oh, that's one of those really pale, pale, like white with a tint of mint green to it. I'm assuming that's probably going in here. Let's see, 19. Yeah, that's all of this. Another pink going on top. Some more blues on the bottom and I'm assuming this will be on the bottom. Oh look at this gorgeous teal. Oh love it. So we have all these teals and greens going on down here and then we have our reds and oranges and pinks going on on the top. Oh that is so pretty. Love it. Very nice. I know I'm going through the drill colors relatively fast. If it's too fast, let me know in the comments below. Um, because I know some of you like to see all the drills. And others, maybe not so much. And if you don't, you can always fast forward through this part. But, because I know some like to see the actual colors rather than what's printed on the canvas because the actual drill colors can be very different than what's printed on here. So. Oh, gorgeous. Yes, these uh, look to be very nice canvases. And if you look on the back, 
even on double-sided adhesive, you can pretty much tell if there's going to be rivers or problems with the canvas because it'll show. There are these ripples in here right now, but that's just because of the clear plastic. Once you peel that off, this will disappear. So, And like I said, I iron my canvases, so... Number two to get back in. <laughs> we shall see. Maybe it'll work better on this end. If I really struggle with one, I'll do it afterwards off camera. That first one went in so nice. Ripped it a little bit on top, but I wish they would have put them in the white um, little sleeves because that is much easier. But this will work. Here we go. So that is the thumbnail. Isn't that gorgeous? It's so different, though, seeing them in person than what they look like online or even in this thumbnail picture. So it's always so exciting to actually get them. Put them boxes up there. I'm going to keep the boxes, though, just in case I need them for something else. All right, so I'm assuming they put the larger ones that I picked out in the boxes because this is a larger one also these pretty colors <laughs> ah, I love it ah, look at these bright colors ah. and then she is holding balloons isn't it neat how that's silhouetted out? Silhouetted a word. As usual, key code upper left, lower right, number, symbol, and DMC code. Look at all this blue. How many shades of blue we have up there? Looks like one, two, three, maybe four. Yeah. Then I'm assuming black. Yes, three tens. Look at these gorgeous pinks, yellow, and oranges. Oh, so pretty. Another standard toolkit. Oh, look at that. And again, pre kit it up for you. I see a purple. Oh yeah, we do have some in through here, don't we? And the symbols again look extremely clear. All right, let's look at the pretties. Number one, purple, of course. <laughs> Whole bunch of 310. Darker red, kind of a army green. Ooh, here's a darker purple. Lots of pink. Look at those two. Oh, they're so pretty. We've got some oranges. A lot of this color. Some yellows and yellow orange. A dark one. And here come the blues. Here come the blues. Holy guacamole. <laughs> so we got this beautiful color. And all of these. <laughs> oh my heavens. One, two, three, four, five. Oh my gosh. This is full. Six. This is a dark, dark blue. These aren't blue. That's seven. Oh, and this one's even fuller, and I love that color. Seven 
blue colors. <laughs> oh, wow. Here's a brown and a maroon. And then another pink. Oh, another purple. And another red brown. Oh my gosh, is that not going to be gorgeous? Oh, I love it. Love it, love it. All right, let's struggle getting these back in. <laughs> I am thinking the other ones might not. Well, I shouldn't say that. We shall see. I was going to say the smaller ones not be kitted up, but all depends upon the company. Um, you know, these come from a specific company, but they use manufacturers, you know, different manufacturers for their diamond painting. So, all depends upon how the manufacturer kits up their diamond paintings. So, so I am assuming the same manufacturer did these first three. You know me and my bright colors. <laughs> Did I say the size? No, that's a 40 by 50. So that is the largest one yet. And I got this crooked. 40 by 50. So yeah, that, that's getting bigger, isn't it? That's getting beyond what we call a snack size. Okay, and that one is right here. Stay. Okay, let's go on to the two that are not in a box. Sure, let's. Mm -hmm. This is a 30 by 40. Oh yeah, Halloween. Isn't that cool? Look at all the blues again in that. So we have our ghoulish person in the background, in the graveyard. Do we have three tens in here? No, no three tens. What is the heart then? Oh, 939. Real dark, dark blue. So this is almost all going to be blues with some yellow, gray, and green. Wow, a lot of blue. So 23 colors in this. Oh, they are kitted up. Wow, isn't that awesome? No cutting open babies. Love it when they do that. There's Sander Toolkit. <laughs> I have so many of them that are coming out of my ears. <laughs> Okie dokie. We have a gray. Here's a dark blue. Let's zoom it in. Dark blue. Here we have them a couple greens. There's a light tan. Boy, it doesn't look like there's that many colors in here, does it? Kind of a tannish green. Here's a light blue. Just a little bit. Kind of a blue gray. Another green. Here come some blues. <laughs> Here's that 939, I'm sure. It's a dark, dark blue. Looks black almost. Some more like sky blues. 
Oh, is that gorgeous? I like to call it a cerulean blue. A lot in there, so you know that's going to be the background. Or in the background. We have a really pretty buttery yellow. Oh, I love this blue too. It's like a royal blue. Kind of a periwinkle blue. And oh my gosh. Look at that color. That is a full bag. <laughs> so the majority of the background is this color. This again is a full round. All of these have been rounds. Full rounds. And a dark blue. Of a yellow. And yet another blue. And then a dark gray. Wow. Yep. I knew there was going to be a lot of blues in here, but boy, I didn't think there were going to be that many shades of green in this. Because it just didn't, you know, i seen some in here, but yeah, a lot of different shades of gray or green and some grays in the yellows. <sighs> pretty. That Well, I don't know if you can call this pretty, but the blues are pretty. <laughs> So neat Halloween picture. And then we have one more in this part one. And yeah, we're at almost a half an hour. So definitely don't want to make this an hour long video. So. Lift you up here a little. Okay, let's see how this one goes. Oh, I don't know about this one. I don't think I have it rolled up tight enough. Oh, sure snow. I think I'm ripping it though again. Yeah, I don't like these cellophane wrappers. They're just too hard. There we go. Okay. Halloween picture. Whoa. Okay, last but not least is this one. Now, where's the ending to this? I don't think it's on that end. Oh my goodness sakes. Come on. Oh my. Well, what in the world? Oh my. I can't even feel it. Oh. <laughs> Do they not want me to get into this one? Definitely doesn't feel like it's at that end. All right, folks, I think we're going to have to cut this one open because I definitely don't see it. <laughs> I'm just going to snip the end open. You just didn't want me to see this one. My heavens. Whew. Okay. Oh yeah, this one, that's so pretty. Isn't that cool? Well, let me zoom out a little bit more. This is a 30 by 40 again, full round. Another toolkit. <laughs> oh, love it, love it, love it. 
looks like there's going to be a lot of confetti in here if you're not familiar with what confetti is. So there's a lot of color changing within here. Now this would be block, you know, drilling. All different colors. I'm not a confetti person, but boy, that's going to be pretty when it's done. 24 colors in this one. And again, symbols look very, very clear. So even in this confetti heavy area, yeah, clear as a bell. Awesome. Okay, again, pre-kitted up. So the same manufacturer must have done all of these tiny things. Now let's see if I can get this part open. Okay. They have that elusive clear glue. And I've said in the past, I think they should make it like red glue or some kind of colored glue. Would make things so much easier. Let's zoom in. Looks like we'll have lots of Sky blues and whites and grays and some browns for the trees. There's a pretty blue. Lots of these two. So it must be background colors. Very dark blue. Dark brown. Very dark blue. Another brown, green. Oh, here comes some blues. Why is it all of them that I picked <laughs> have a lot of blues? <laughs> Must have been in a blue mood. Because, yeah, we have tons of blues. Look at that. Kind of an aqua blue. Light tan. Another tan, and then we have some grays. So a lot of shading in this picture, and that's why there's so much confetti and 24 colors. Some more grays, quite a few of that one. And again, these drills look really good. And another blue. And a real deep green. Oh, uh, five for five. <laughs> These are so pretty. Oh my gosh. I would like to thank a diamond painting for sending these to me. And, uh, yeah, these are very, very nice. Put these back in. Now, I will leave a link to a diamond painting to their website. And then I will link these five particular diamond paintings, if they are all still available. I am assuming they will be. And then in part two, I will also link the company and those five specific diamond paintings. So I'm hoping to record part two shortly. So you should be seeing part two soon. Now, I don't know if this is going to fit in this one because of having to cut it the way I did. Unless I just put it in one of the boxes. Maybe I can fit it in a box. And do it that way, because otherwise I'm afraid I'll lose the drills. Otherwise I do have some boxes upstairs. Oh yeah, that'll fit in there good. Where there's a will, there's a way, right? 
Okay, so that is this one. All right, so we have our beautiful tree, our ghoulish Halloween picture, beautiful girl holding the balloons, gorgeous trees, and Essa and Anna. Aren't they pretty? I love them. All right, so again, I will have part two up a little while after this part one. So thank you so much again to A Diamond Painting for sending me all of these diamond paintings. It was so generous of you. Um, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this unbaking. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. I hope everybody's having a fantastic day. And as always, happy coloring. Bye, guys.